What's up guys, it's Crazy Ninja Gaming, welcome back to another video, and this video, I'm going to be talking more about the NBA, I'm going to be talking about something that happened today, now as you guys know, only a couple of days ago, Carmelo Anthony got traded to the OKC, which was a fucking huge trade, it was unbelievable, it was really crazy when it happened, what the fuck's happening with my hair, I don't know, yeah it was really crazy when it happened, by the way, sorry that my hair's all fucking messed up, I need a haircut, my hair's freaking crazy. I badly need a haircut, as you guys obviously can tell. And also, before I get to this video quickly, I just need to, I'm just going to say, sorry if, if I won't be yelling in this video. It's actually very late at night right now, so I need to try to, you know, keep keep my voice down and not be too loud. But guys, I need to tell you guys something. As you guys know, a couple of days ago, from what I said before, or well, just before, uh... Carmelo got traded to the OKC, which was a huge freaking trade. Like, it was crazy. But guess what, guys? Guess what just... It was probably actually yesterday, because it's around midnight right now in Perth. My boy, D-Wade. Now, as you guys know in that OKC video where I was telling you guys about Carmelo getting traded, I told you guys about D-Wade, like, definitely getting traded to a team. Like, he definitely wants out from the Bulls. But I wasn't 100% sure what team was going to. But guys, my boy D. Wade goes to the Cleveland Cavaliers. Bro. Bro. Guys, I, I've been wanting D. Wade to go to the Cavs for so long. And D. Wade has finally gone to the Cavs. Do you guys know how good that is? Do you know how good that fucking is? If he works out, if he works good in the Cavs, their team could be fucking overpowered. Think about it. This is the starting five for the Cavs, right? Isaiah Thomas, point guard. J.R. Smith, small guard. LeBron, small forward, obviously. Power forward, Kevin Love, and center, Trishan Thompson. But think about this. D. Wade, through the game, can then be the sub for J.R. Smith because he's a bit of an order player. And then think about it because D Wade's still pretty good because he like D Wade's still pretty good. He's still a scorer and stuff. So just imagine, I don't know, Cavs is down by Cavs is down by fifteen or something, and the subs have to come in. D Wade is able to bring his team back. He can do it because he's done it plenty of times before. So just imagine how good that could be. Plus, you guys all know how good D Wade is when it comes to playoffs time. So if he works out good in the Cavs, which I hope he does, him in the playoffs. He could be fucking deadly as hell. He, he could be so good. And obviously, as you guys know, him and LeBron used to be teammates. So, guys, D Wade and LeBron, they could be another for it, like good good uh, friendship right there. Because as you guys know, back in Miami, when LeBron was in Miami with D Wade, they were really good teammates. And they really worked well together. Let's hope it happens again. Let's hope it freaking happens again because that could be so good. Like, I thought, oh, because Kyrie's leaving the Cavs. This is when he left the Cavs. I thought, oh, Cavs are over. But no, Cavs are right back in it. Now that they got D Wade, that's just changed a lot. Like, they're right back in it. I don't think the Cavs are getting to Marcus Cousins now, though. I'm pretty sure he's staying in New Orleans Pelicans. But still, Cavs got D Wade, which is fucking unbelievable. That's another start of their team. Like, holy crap, that's fucking good. And, like, bro, d can kind of play point guard as well. So, since Isaiah Thomas can't really play good defense, uh, if they need d to swap with him, then they can because d can actually play defense. I'm not saying Isaiah Thomas isn't good. He's a good offensive player, but because he's literally he can't really play defense. So, d would be better for that. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. It's just a quick video. Tell you guys about the hype about this freaking trade. Again, sorry for not really yelling. It is late at night uh, in Perth right now. So, again, that's the reason for me not being too loud. Um, so, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you did, leave a like. Also, tell me comments below if you're hyped about the trade for d -way going to the Cavs. Also, tell me comments below if you reckon the Cavs could win the championship now with this trade. Tell the comments below for that. So that would be very interesting to know. And subscribe for you. You guys are bloody legends. You guys are crazy. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.